just a cookery show, that, is it? I mean, it feels like this is a, almost like a travel log, the yeah. scenery and the places you go to. It's all about the people, isn't it? And um, I think what's so nice about food and, dare I say it, travel to the Mediterranean is compared to 30, 50, 100 years ago, like, we can all go there if yeah. we choose to. It's really easy to get to, doesn't take much time. And then if you think about the old school diet, now we can go to supermarkets and markets and just get this array of incredible things. You. And, like, when I started at The Naked Chef, balsamic vinegar, like, no one had ever mm. had it. Isn't that And my editor was going, maybe you shouldn't put it in the book. And, of course, no now way. it's in every dodgy place. You know, it's just, it's just <laughs> prolific, right? So... Do you know what I like about you on telly, Jamie? Every new series feels like you've just started again. Your yeah. enthusiasm's yeah. always there. You have that kind of boyish giddiness so about true. you. You, you really you. love it, don't you? I, I do love it, and, and I love working for the public, and I... And I the real, I think the real reason I, I've got a long career is because I listen hard. And for someone that talks too much is hard for me. <laughs> so I try to listen and I see where people's problems are, what annoys them, how their lives are changing. Yeah. It's changed a lot since The Naked Chef and the way people are living, the pressure on, on parents uh, and, like, how you juggle it all. So, like, how do we not just reheat stuff that someone else has produced? Yeah. So, yeah. what I've tried, like, having minimal ingredients, really important. And, and for Jules, Jules is watching, by the way. Morning, um, Jules. Bless you, Jules. Love you, love you. We're going to do this dish that I wrote for her, actually. Five ingredients, minimal shopping, nice and easy, big flavours. Uh, and, and there's plenty of healthy dishes in the book, as well as indulgent ones that I'm about oh, to serve you. We are going now, indulgent. Five ingredients. Puff pastry, already rolled for you. This is the paper it comes on. How easy do you want it? It's got sliced apples, almonds, apricot jam in the oven, super quick, super fine, super delicious, bit of ice cream, happy days. It's the Sweet easiest time. dessert yeah, known. Um, and then I'm going to do a little homage to my beautiful wife. OK. Um, so Jules doesn't drink. Oh, I can't get it. And uh, I wish she did, but she doesn't. Um, so what we have is um, a young lady mm. that is a lover of chocolate. Chocolate does it for her. Oh, my right? word. It, it's, it, it's like the one time I see her really, really happy. Does she like dark chocolate, milk chocolate? Any chocolate, any in chocolate. all kinds of versions. Oh. Um, 150 grams, uh, good, good chocolate, 125 grams of butter. Um, and then we're going to put in 50 grams of her other sort of loved ingredient, coffee. Oh. Now, this is a woman that loves coffee. I have never seen anyone have... I think it's because she doesn't drink. She has this... Mad relationship with coffee. Certain times of the day, let everyone be quiet. No one in trouble. It's just a coffee Off moment. Time. So I thought, what could I do? Yeah. How many cups a day does she have? Three. Three. That's I wish it. she had five or ten, no. but she won't. She's very healthy, very structured. What time's the last one? Uh, six o'clock. Oh, that's six a o'clock. Oh, oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But she's got go a, like she gets day. a nice little half hour hit, and and I like the hit because then she's very agreeable. Aren't we, George? <laughs> um, bless You're you. You're a brave, very Mr. Lover, lover. You're a brave man. Uh, listen, I, we're 23 years in, and uh, what can you do? Um, I put a little post up the other day. Nothing more attractive than a man that can cook, uh, oh. but nothing more attractive than a man that cooks and washes up. <laughs> so, um, listen, um, so she loves coffee and chocolate. Um, we've got oh that my in. Gosh. Have 50, you done it? 50 meals so of good amazing. chocolate. The be, uh, 50 meals of good coffee. And then here we've got oh. two eggs and uh, 125 uh, grams How is of that so good? sugar. I've never tasted anything like that. Are you in the chocolate right. already? OK. Yeah. So, what... We've this is early it reveal. Almost, well, talk, sorry, talk to me about it. Talk to me about it. It was almost like eating... I don't know what it just did in my mouth, but it's a sensation I've never... It just went... Yeah. Yeah. And yes. just then there's waft of coffee and chocolate just so in me. Plays havoc with you. No, listen, there's, you're... Salt, there's salt in there oh and yes, the sweet. Is there and salt there's... in there? OK. Right. So, we've only got five ingredients, right? You're seeing me do this, but it's about texture. Eggs that are in it, they're very delicate. Chocolate is very delicate. So we're going to cook it, as you'll see. I've now whisked the eggs and sugar till it's nice and fine. <laughs> and I'll put the chocolate in. Um, hopefully, you agree that this is a very good expression of chocolate. Well, yeah. I think Jules has got very good taste, quite clearly, because this is well, incredible. Yeah, don't worry, it's really chocolate chocolate good taste for me. It's really interesting. Yeah, what? It's a really interesting range of flavours. It's like a kind of... Exp it's very... Uh, it's coffee, coffee and yeah. chocolate, it, 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 uh, uh, they do have a harmony and a relationship mm. together that's very nice. So, look, you can cook it in a big dish if you want, but this one, I wanted to give Jules her very own portion, um, which is always very important. <laughs> and um, I'm just going to put a nice little bit in okay. each of these cups. We're going to cook it for 20 minutes exactly. The oven is set to 120 degrees Celsius, and I'm going to put about an inch of water in this tray to create humidity that takes... 126? Uh, uh, what did you say? 120 degrees Celsius. Did I, I do often talk about No, rubbish. no, I, it's, I think it might be me. So it's quite a low oven, then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you so want eggs, to just... gentle. Gentle, chocolate, gentle. Gentle, the fats. So it's not just the flavour. Hopefully you agree that the flavour of chocolate and coffee is amazing, but, yeah. but it's the texture. Well, because almost at the bottom, it's got that gooeyness, like the best bit inside... 
any mousse or brownie. Yes. You know, it's got, it's got that there. It's all about the texture. So if it's you want to so do this light. for a dinner party, you can do it yeah. in the morning. What I'm going to do is just put the kettle in, boiling water, half fill it, 20 minutes. Is that a bain marie? Yes. Yes. God. Yeah. Is You're it? good. You're, how good are you? It's very good. So good. I'll, I'll take it. Yeah. Uh, you can times the recipe by two, three, four. You can do 20. <laughs> it's fantastic so for well. parties. Yeah. As you can see, you, you can put it on like a little cup saucer. It's cute. Odds and sods cups. But it really, looks really nice. Beautiful serve like that. I, I think so. And and Jules really liked it. So as she gave me the thumbs up, um, I thought I'd put it in the book. And then when it went into text uh, testing, um, you kind of get responses back and, and everyone's like, oh, well... How many know. versions would you do of this before you go, yeah, that's the one? Uh, a lot. OK, normally, a few, I can normally dream a recipe within 85% of correction. Um, this wow. one, I got 99% right straight away. No. Um, I don't know why, maybe it was love. Do you always... Maybe it was the, oh. the prospect of love. I love my friends. Um, but I got it right first time. And um, uh, that was just luck, by the way. It's not me being efficient. Um, but, yeah, I think it was trying to create the harmony between chocolate and coffee. Mm. Eggs suspending it, mm -hmm. you know, and um, it's, it's, look, I think this five ingredient thing is interesting. It makes you have restraint. Mm. It's very easy to throw in. <laughs> Good lad. Go on. Good I'm lad. nearly there. Mm. So, yeah, you're nearly there. I hope you like it. I've got some for, t for you to take home. Jamie, it changes. The flavour's changing yeah. the longer it stays in your mouth. That's what okay. I think as well. The one thing I didn't say, and it says this in the book, that, like, when it comes out of the oven, let it cool down for two mm. hours in the bain marie. Mm. Um, this one has been in the fridge. Just try that for, for a difference. With um, pleasure. So this is... I'm just oh. trying, to, I'm trying to teach you about how sure, temperature sure. changes the proteins and the fats. Nice too, but um, that one's You can taste better. it more, yeah. Jamie, We're just thank eat you. This now. The thank Jamie you. Cook's Mediterranean, Sunday, 8 pm on Channel 4, and the book is out now as well. You know where to go. The free this morning app has details of all the recipes.